Hello, I'm Jenna. This is the Stamp is Mess. Thank you for joining me. I'm not live at the moment. I am pre-recording this video. I tried to go live with this one, but my internet connection was too unstable and it kept dropping out. So I've given up on that and I'm pre-recording instead. So I'm starting again from scratch. So if you didn't see any of that live, then you're going to see all of it here anyway. So I was going to be here, I told you last week I was going to be here with a video showcasing at least one of the kits from the Stamping Up Kits collection because we do have a sale on. So Stamping Up has a sale on of 10, 20 or 30% off all of their kits this month. And so I was going to showcase those for you. But a couple of exciting things happened, so I'm going to put that off for next week. So the first one was this happened. So this is the brand new September to December mini catalog. And I, this actually arrived. So I've got my own paper copy. We got to see, as demonstrators, we got to see a PDF version about a week ago. But now I have my actual one to look through, which is lovely. But also I got my pre-order. So demonstrators got a chance to pre-order two days ago. We got, we got the chance to order from those brand new products. And mine arrived, I think, 37 hours it took from ordering to arrival at my door, which must be a record. And I won't expect it to happen again, but super exciting that it did happen this time. So I'm going to take you down to my desk and I'm going to show you some of the things that I've got. So... This is the catalogue. I can't show you inside at the moment. It's only for demonstrators' eyes at this point. Uh, but it will go live on, uh, oh, it's in September. So let me just check the date. It is the 6th of September. So not the 1st, but the 6th of September. It will go live for everybody. Uh, but in the meantime, I can show you what I got in my box. So a couple of things jumped out at me straight away. And one of the must-haves was this duo here of a Bear Punch and the Berry Cute stamp set. These are just adorable and you can see they're coordinated together. So this is actually part of an entire suite of products. And I don't often get the whole suite of products in the catalogs. There are lots of them in all the catalogs and they have a whole lot of coordinating products, but I usually just pick and choose the ones that I really like. But this time around, I've actually ordered three whole suites of products. So I'm gonna show you this one. So the extra uh, products are, that are in this suite, which is the Berry Christmas suite. So the Berry Christmas suite. Uh, so is this paper. So the, the Berry Christmas paper. So the punch actually punches out some of the images from this as well. So you can see anyway, you've got that kind of shaped bear. It will cut that out. But then there are also all these other images. So the, this is obviously a Christmas paper set, but it's also a wintry paper set and can be used for other things. Uh, so you've got these, these patterns here that match kind of the scarf and the sweater that the bear is wearing. And then we've got some presents and some snowflakes and some more polar bears there. And then on the flip side, you have all these coordinating patterns. So you've got the trees. And then my favorite piece of paper of all is this one here. I don't know what it is, but these footprints with these presents, it just makes my heart sing. So I really love this one. Uh, and then you've got all these other ones with some extra creatures and extra snowflakes and patterns as well. So that's part of the suite. In addition, we've also got an embossing folder. So there's this one here, which is the Snowflake Sky 3D embossing folder. And I've just quickly run a piece through so that you can see what that looks like. If I hold that in the right way, you can see all that deep detail in there that's been embossed with that. There is also this balmy blue ribbon. It's kind of velvety. It's called a sparkle ribbon because it is just full of sparkles and it's really soft and beautiful. And then there's also some more sparkles in these ones here called the adhesive backed glitter sequins. So there's a couple of different sizes and three different colors of little glittery sequins that coordinate with all the products. And then also in the suite is the Memories and More component. So the Memories and More cards pack is this one. So it has two, two sizes of cards, the large and the small, and they're double-sided. So you have patterns and you have images and you also have a couple of sticker sheets. And so there's two of each design of sticker sheet that all coordinate as well. And then you have the small size ones that are also double-sided and you have patterns and greetings and panels that you can write in and all those kinds of things. So the Memories and More is designed for pocket scrapbooking. We'll look at that. It's got the little uh, footprints in that as well with the Let It Snow. That's so cute. So these are designed for pocket scrapbooking. And so you pop these in with photos and you do a bit of journaling and you do it that way. But they're also great for making cards with. So there is also, as part of the suite, there is this pack of cards and envelopes that are matching. And so there's two different designs. There's a red one and a blue one, and they each have a matching envelope. 
like that. And what you can do is you can actually use, all right, so you can make them however you want, but you can actually use the Memories of More cards to also make cards using the cards and envelopes. If you, you can put a couple of layers on, you can fit those on there. So you can see you can add them and make your cards really quickly and easily. So that's the Memories of More part of that, which is very cute, but the suite of products in itself is just adorable. So let me just move them out of the way so that I can move on and show you the next one. So the next suite of products that I got is one that is uh, based around this stamp set and this die set. So this is the Magical Meadow bundle and this is a distinctive stamp set and it has those extra little layers so you get multiple colours out of the one stamp and then it has all of these dies. So it's a two piece, two sheet die set. Uh, so you've got all these little bits of foliage and then you've got these shapes here that will go around it as well but what i love about this one what caught my eye first is the papers so these papers sorry i'll just try and find all the right bits these papers here are called winter meadow and that's the whole suite is called winter meadow and you can see what i mean here at this is that same kind of watercolour look that you get from those distinctive stamps and that's the kind of texture that you'll get from the stamping as well so these are just gorgeous papers that you can use for all sorts of occasions. So some of them are kind of wintry images and some of them kind of have that feel of Christmas to them, like these beautiful watercolour trees. But other ones can be used for all sorts of occasions and it doesn't have to be Christmassy at all. This one is just adorable. Look at these deer done in this watercolour element here. That is just beautiful. And then the flip side, you have all these gorgeous patterns that you can also use for your projects. So lots of gorgeous things there. So in addition to that, in this particular suite, so we've got the papers and the stamp set and dies, there is also another set of papers, which is the, um, sorry, I've lost them now. So this is the foiled papers. So this, Three different patterns and they're all kind of foiled snowflake images in different colors let me just double check what those are called they are called snowflake magic uh, and there's two of each sheet in that pack in addition to that there is also this ribbon here which is a kind of white and silver edged ribbon it is called sheer ribbon and you can see how beautiful that is and it's it's so uh, flexible and easy to work with let me just see if there was something else yes there is there's some more gems here as well that coordinate so this one is a faceted gems trio pack so there's three different colors of faceted gems so those work really really nicely as a suite of products as well so i did actually get another suite um, but i'm going to come back to that later it's a non-christmasy one so um, I'm going to come back. I'm going to show you a few more of the kind of Christmas products first of all. So this bundle here, the Merry and Bright bundle. I love greetings like this. These greetings where you ink it up and then the background is a colour and then your greeting is in white. I just love it. just makes it really easy and saves you having to do that heat embossing to get the same look. But also means that you can stamp it and cut it out really easily because you just follow those lines of those, those greetings just there. I also love that Santa was here. We haven't had one like that in a while. Uh, and I love lots of elements in this. But one of the things that really <laughs> got, caught my eye in the dies is this little filament here that goes in the lamps. It's actually heart-shaped. Isn't that cute that they thought to do that? I haven't worked out what these little elements are yet, but I'll have a play and figure that out. And uh, we can have a few different things. So these actually, I keep looking at them as mugs. These are actually the, the top of the uh, the lights. They can they sit up vertical like that, but I keep looking at them as little mugs. So I might have a play with that kind of thing as well. So that's another bundle that we have. So the next bundle I wanted to show you is the Merriest Trees bundle. So this is a Christmas tree set with the dies that go along with that and it's obviously got these extra details as well it's got your decoration pieces it's got your tag and you've got all these elements so we've got this we wish you a Merry Christmas that fits inside the tree itself and it's, um, you can see there the tree is quite big and you can have either the detailed tree or the solid tree but what I also love about this is that these dies these different die pieces for the tree 
actually die cut different parts of the tree in different sizes. So you can have the five tier tree or the four tier tree or the three tier tree and it just cuts it out for you. So you stamp it once and then cut out the size you want, which I thought was amazing. So the next one here is Sending Cheer. So this is a bundle, it's kind of a tag bundle uh, that you can use. So it has the envelope and the present and the gingerbread man and all those elements and it has those in the dies as well with those little hooks on the top so you can cut those hooks off if you don't want to use them as a tag but you can you have them there ready to go if you do so lots of fun with that one there and then i have another bundle that isn't christmasy but it's kind of that season you could use it for all sorts of occasions but obviously it's uh, new year is one of the big ones for it so we've got that new year greeting but it's a fireworks bundle so you have these stamps here and the dies that will also create that fireworks so this is going to cut all those little fireworks holes so you do that in a dark piece and then behind it you add lots of shimmer and shine and bright colors to give the idea of all of that um, fireworks going off which is just lovely so then i've got a couple of single products that i've got they are parts of bundles but i haven't got the whole bundle so this one here is a new punch uh, i can't remember the name of it off the top of my head but it's a lovely kind of oval leaf, squared off oval shape um, that I will definitely use for all sorts of things. The stamp set that went with that wasn't particularly appealing to me. This one here was also a gasp moment when I saw it in the catalogue and there was no way I wasn't getting it. These are deckled circles dies. So there's lots and lots and lots of layering dies and you can go really big and we haven't had a really big circle die for some time. Um, so we can play around with different things but they've got that kind of rough deckled edge to them to match the deckled rec rectangle styles that we already have in the annual catalogue. So those will be fun to play with as well. There's another embossing folder. This one is uh, not a 3D one, but it's called Christmas Tidings Embossing Folder and it has all these words. So it's not necessarily greetings as such because it says things like joyful and decoration and festive and reindeer. So they're not greetings in their own right, but they're a lovely set of words that just speak Christmas. So that's what it looks like when it's been embossed. So really nice there. The next one I have is, or I have a few products that are designed to go with products in the annual catalog. So this one here, More Wishes, has those Christmas greetings. And so you can use it for all, all the things coming up at this time of year. And it goes just as well with this Biggest Wish stamp set, which you might already have. It's been around for a little while now and it's in the annual catalog. So you can mix and match and have have those ones. So you've got Merry in here, but you've got Happy over here. So you can say Happy Wishes or Happy Christmas uh, and, and mix and match which ones you want. So Birthday Wishes. So they go together in lots of different ways, which is great. So um, that was a must have for me as well. The next one is just a single stamp set. So this is so sincere. This is a Million Sales Achievers design one. So I can't remember her name. It's a shame it doesn't say it on the actual set. But um, one of the demonstrators who has sold a million in product over her career. So she got to design a stamp set. So this is what she designed. And it's just a lovely set of greetings that are different to what we often have in things in the way that they, they say. Um, just love spending time with you. Knowing you brings joy to my heart. There are, there are just lovely things to say. I hope your day is a happy one. It doesn't have to be about your birthday. It can just be have a good day. So, And I also love this vertical happy birthday. I know I'll be using that one. Another single stamp set is just this one. Here's a fragrant forest. It's a background stamp. So it's just that one. And it has all of that detail in there. So you can do all these, these trees. Uh, so I had, had to get that one. This is another one that co coordinates with a... Um, product in the annual catalog. So this is Shop the Town and it works with the Let's Go Shopping stamp set. So it kind of just adds some Christmas elements to the village that you can create. And there's all of those features and also coordinates with the dies that uh, were brought out as part of the bundle for Let's Go Shopping. So it's just in addition to that. There are a couple more uh, stamp sets and products in that catalog that go with uh, products from the annual catalog that I don't have so I haven't got the new ones and I don't have the old ones so I can't show you but when we get to looking in the actual catalog itself when you get a chance to have a look keep an eye out for those because you might find that there are things that are going to expand the products that you already have so I'm going to go now to some more papers 
and I'm going to show you a couple of things. So this paper pack here, this one here is called, let me pick, pick up the pack, this is called A Walk in the Forest and it has some lovely Christmassy scenes but also just kind of forest scenes. It has more bears and look at that, that's going to coordinate with the bear punch that I've now buried under products. So this punch here is going to cut out this bear here. So the other papers were all polar bears, these ones are brown bears and obviously you can stamp your bears and colour them whatever colours you want. So this gives some other options for what to do with this punch. So there's more patterns in here. So they are Christmas themed in a lot of cases. Some more bears you can punch out. Some more patterns and then on the back there's all of these patterns as well that will work really nicely but the other thing about this is that this is our product give back so this is uh this year's product that has been chosen by stamping up and i don't have all the details yet i will get them for you but this one is a charity fundraising one so a portion of the sales uh, that that all of these papers like the money that comes in from the sale of all these papers will be donated to charities so I'll come back to you with the details of what those are when I have more, more of those details for you. But that's what this one actually is designed for. Uh, so the next one is a set of papers that goes with the kind of nativity scene stamp set. So this one's called Oh Holy Night. Uh, and there's a nativity themed stamp set that I haven't got, but I do love the papers. So you can see here that it, there's kind of that night sky and desert imagery uh, that you can use for all sorts of things. And I actually looked at some of these and thought I can use them with the, the space shuttle and the astronaut and the planets that are in one of the annual catalog products as well. And then you have these far more traditional kind of Christmas star scenes and then that desert scene there. So you can have your camels and, and wise men traveling. Uh, and then the flip sides to all of those are there. So different things you can do with those. Another paper pack I have here is this one here, which is on the autumn theme. So obviously this, this calendar is kind of based on the American market. It's an American company. So we're coming into spring, they're coming into autumn. But that doesn't stop me loving some of these images that I've got in here. So this is called All About Autumn. And it's a specialty paper pack and it's six by six. So by specialty, it means that it has uh, extra elements to it, which in this case is on the flip side, there's all these gold foiled elements to it. So you've got all of these kind of fancy papers that you can use. And this is going to be tricky for me because do I use the fancy foiled sides or do I use this gorgeous photo wheel kind of elements of papers here that show lots of different elements? So there are things in there for kind of Thanksgiving and autumn that I wouldn't use, but there are other elements like the books and the textures and the forests and the wood grains that I will use as well. So there's, and then there's those flip sides. So lots and lots of things to have fun with there. Now I'm going to get to the other suite that I bought. So this one was a little bit of a toss up for me of whether I would or I wouldn't because I normally get something Halloween themed because I love Halloween. We do do Halloween, but I don't usually make a lot of uh, cards for Halloween. So I don't I don't use it for that kind of purpose, but I do try and get something kind of Halloween ish from the range. And this really appealed to me. What didn't appeal so much is how much work it's going to be to stamp all these individual pieces and cut them out. But on the other hand, I'm going to like the outcome of being able to customize things. So I was tossing up on this one whether I was, was motivated enough to do all that work. And then there is this one here that is a whole skeleton ready to go that you can just add the hats to. So there's a, a beret and a cowboy hat and various things. And you can actually cut him out just once. So that kind of sold it when I realized I could do that. I also love these extra elements like fences and, and those kinds of things. So, and the cat and the dog, aren't they so cute? So then I looked at those and I thought, oh, I'm gonna have a look at the other things in this suite. And one of the other things is these glow in the dark bats and ghosts. So I don't know how well you can see those. And some glow in the dark paper. So I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna use glow in the dark paper for, but 
who doesn't want bow in the dark paper so i had to get some of that as well and then there's the paper pack that goes with this suite so this one is called let me look it up them bones so the whole suite is called them bones and this one has one of these sheets that's kind of like um, the Freshers of Daisy papers in the annual catalog. It's this collage sheet. So you can use all of these elements on uh, individual projects. And so I love this one here. Uh, and But it says Creep It Real is so cute. And then this one here is just asking to have one of those skeletons stamped and cut out and put in there. There's also these ones here that kind of work in the same way. So you cut it in half. And you use them up this way or the other, then you've got duplicates of it the other way and then you've got these other patterns and things that go with these so i love these kind of images for kind of kids birthdays and fun stuff they don't have to be halloween like skeletons don't have to be a halloween thing obviously they are associated with halloween so if you want to do a halloween you can but they don't have to be um, and then these ones here are going to match that die in that set and i'm just going to look at the flip side as well and so you have these kinds of patterns that match in this kind of range. So lots of fun stuff there. So that was the last of what I know. It's not the last of what I was going to show you. It was the last of the suite. And I've got two more products that I've got. Let me just move these out of the way so I can show you what else is here. So I have two more ribbons. So this one is called the glittered ribbon and this is navy so this is knight of navy and gold and this actually is part of the suite that these papers belong to so you can see how that's going to tie in with those ones so i've got kind of ribbon that goes with those papers and then the other one is this ribbon here which is the iridescent ribbon so it's a white ribbon but it's got where can i hold it so you can see it's kind of oops shiny so it's not individual sparkles let me move this out I'm having trouble focusing on one thing so can we oh, it's not coming up on camera but there is some iridescent kind of sparkle to that one and that goes with one of the suites where i haven't got most of the other pro uh, products in it um but i have got the ribbon because i love it so hopefully you can see that there so i'm going to come back to me now and I hope you've enjoyed having a trawl through all of those products with me. Um, I've been having fun and I am really looking forward to having a play with those. So I've got a couple of things coming up. I've got my catalog launch in September and bookings are open for that now. So I'm going to put the details for that up on my Facebook page as well so that you can book in for your spot with that. So that will be um, in mid-September. But before that, I need to be creating with these brand new products because I'm heading off to Las Vegas in a couple of weeks. And part of what I'm doing over there is I'm doing a swap for new catalog products. So I'm going to take 20 of my project over there that I've created, 20 of the same thing, and I'm going to be sharing that and then get back 20 different projects made with new catalog products. So I'll have lots of things to show you when I get back. So I've got to get cracking on those. So I'm so glad that my order arrived really quickly. I was getting worried about how much time I was going to have to play before I went away. But all good. So I will see you again next week. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.